Welcome back to the Bills Bunker. I'm Jake Varco, and today I'm going to be live from Highmark Stadium, where the Buffalo Bills are meeting up with the Pittsburgh Steelers in a Week 5 matchup. The Buffalo Bills coming into this game with a record of 3-1. and one. The Steelers are 1-3. and three. It's going to be Kenny Pickett making his first career NFL start, and he's going to have a tough challenge at hand. Potential windy day here in Buffalo. And of course, that Buffalo defense is stellar. Both teams are currently facing a plethora of injuries, so the best team will emerge victorious in this game. The deepest team will emerge victorious. I'll see you inside. Talk to you then. Gabe Davis, oh man, Josh Allen. The Gabe Davis 99 yard touchdown on the opening drive. The Bills from their one yard line. Josh Allen connects. Gabe Davis takes it all the way in. Bills off early. What an opening drive. Now that I'm at the seat, Buffalo Bills on possession. Gonna try to make this a 13 0 game. Gabe Davis just reels in that top. One handed job. That's the second most job of the first half. Bills lead 17 3. Touchdown reception to 33 game. PAT attempt. Tyler Bath. Gabriel Davis, two receptions for 160 yards. Absolutely insane. I'm honestly expecting to see second string players going into the second half here. Like I said, 31 3. This game has been a ball. It's been a no contest. The best of men can get. Fans, take out the scoreboard for a look at these Seneca Resorts and Casino. This is bad. This is really bad. 
Another point after attempt coming from Tyler Bass. James Cook just took that one to the house. A two play drive leads to another Buffalo touchdown. And the point after attempt is good. It's good. 38-3, the Buffalo Bills absolutely demolish the Pittsburgh Steelers, 38-3. So that means in two home games, the Buffalo Bills have outscored their opponents 79-10. Josh Allen in this game, career high 424 passing yards. And that's also the most by any Bills quarterback in regulation. The offense amassed over 500 offensive yards. The defense holding the Steelers just three points. This Bills team has been fantastic, just phenomenal. They advance to a four and one record and the Steelers fall to one and four. Next week, it's a big test for this Bills team. They head to Arrowhead Stadium to take on the Kansas City Chiefs in a rematch of last year's AFC divisional round game.